welcome. This is Melissa Armo with the Stock Swoosh, and I wanted to review here Facebook. It was a really great call from last week, and so I'm going to review the trade, and it's really about understanding gaps. There's so many people out there that trade the U.S. stock market and have no concept of gaps, don't understand what a gap is, don't know how to read gaps, and they are so important, and this is what I teach people how to do, and my eye goes right to a gap when I'm reviewing a chart. If you'd like more information, you can email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com or call me at 929-3200-GAP. You can also follow me on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, or Skype. So here it is. This is the chart just going back the last few months here. Um, previously, the stock had made brand new all-time highs back in July. Okay, this was up over 218. Then it collapsed in here on this day all the way down in the 170s. So quite quite a Jimungo gap down for Facebook, okay? And you can see what it's done ever since. So this was the day trade from Friday that we're gonna review. I also called a put in this trade, which worked last week too. So you can trade stocks using options uh, and you can also do it uh, day trading. The day trades are the quick trades, the options trades, you can, you can play them for quick trades. But the only benefit really of doing options is that you don't have to concern yourself with margin or buying power or have a a margin day trading account. But to get in and out quickly and maneuver yourself in seconds or minutes, day trading is it. So anyways, we're gonna look here at this. This is again, Friday the 28th, last day of the month. Now there was news that came out on this stock. I forget the exact time of the day that it happened, but either way, we were in the trade. I called the trade on Monday for the put and Friday morning before the news even came out. It was a short, okay? So obviously there was negative news that came out that created a bigger move. I didn't know anything about that news coming out. I didn't know anything about it at all. We were already in, in invested, okay, in the short before that news even broke that there was a data breach again in Facebook. So that's the amazing thing to me is that I can see, I'm gonna go back here, what's happening in a chart to pinpoint the direction before, before, okay, before the move even occurs. Um, which is which is how you make money when you trade. So when you learn how to read gaps, right? Go back to this as a daily chart, okay? That it can help tell you how to take the stock in the position to go long it or short it. I'm reading institutional money in the stock. It's very important because obviously if you were in this short on Friday, you had the possibility of making a lot of money and if you were in it long, you lost, okay? You lost. And there were people that were long the stock or there were people that are still long the stock. Now let's take a look here. This was the day trade in Facebook. So the initial entry, 167.40. Then the stop was 168.60, okay? Shares, again, first entry in the morning, and this was very, very late. This wasn't even aggressive. 2,000, this is an advanced trader risk. Ad was around 167. Then total risk, the stop was moved, was 2,600. Again, this is an advanced risk. Share quantity, 4,000. Exit, 163.02. This went to, I think, 162.50, I think, or something. This kept going. Um, this went way past every dream target for it. Profit on this day trade, you could have made $16,720, risking 2,600. That is a great trade. What did you do? You played this move here. You play this move here. What an amazing call. So again, looking at this, you say, well, how did you know it was gonna happen? I didn't, but I knew the stock was gonna drop. I didn't know the data breach was gonna happen, but I knew the stock was gonna drop. Because the data breach happened, it created a bigger drop, but I can read that a big drop is coming, a coming in the stock from reading the price action in the gaps. And that is what I teach in my class in the Golden Gap course, and that's the reason to come and pay me to learn my method and system. This was a great call. And I hope everyone in the room got this trade and held it through into that drop. Uh, I have to go back and look at the exact time the news happened, but it was very obvious then when it started to sell off because selling action happens quick, panic actions, uh, action happens quick, and that's one of the reasons why I prefer to look at shorts. Now, what if you did not want to take 4,000 shares of Facebook? Well, you still could have done the exact same trade with a beginner account. You could have taken initially 200 shares and added you would have had 400 again. The entries in the stop is the same. Your risk would have been $260. Share quantity 400, you could have made $1,672 with a small account risking only 260 bucks. That's a great trade. That is a great trade, okay? For to be able to risk $260 and make 1672, 
Their wish to reward in this trade was 6.4, and again, you could have held it longer. I don't know what it was down near near the low. If you held it down in the 162s, it was at probably seven, seven risk or greater. The idea, though, is that you are getting the move in the momentum, playing the gap, rating the gap, following my trades that I'm calling in the live trading room. If you want to learn how to day trade, you can work for yourself from home. You don't have to live in New York. You don't even have to live in the United States of America. You can work for yourself and learn how to do it in my Golden Gap course. It's about having financial freedom. You can do another job. You can have your own business. You can work part time. You can do anything you want. Trading gaps is something you can do with a computer from anywhere in the world. We prefer to watch in the morning. That trade, though, was something that fell later. You had to hold it through later. And the reason we held it was because I could see that the drop was going to come, okay? And again, that was before the news broke. So the nice thing about trading is that you can work from home if you want to do this full-time, but the hours really are not full-time. It's not 40 hours a week. It's not a 40-hour week job. So I teach a class once a month. The class is called the Golden Gap Course. It is October 6th and 7th, 9 to 5 Eastern Time. Cost of the class is $5,499 US dollars. The class is online. You can be anywhere in the world and take it. The cost of the class is increasing with a new website launch this month. This is the last class you can get in for this price. Do not delay. If you've been considering taking my class, sign up. You can get in and trade and learn during earnings season, which starts this coming week. The Golden Gap and the Trends Together combo is $59.99, you save $500. That class is October 22nd. It's from 11 to 5, okay? Email me if you want to sign up. Email me if you have questions. Email me if you want to try to the trading room this week before the class. Uh, I, I hope you think about that trade. This was a great example of something of how I read the price action before that news broke. I read that Facebook was lower. It was a great call. So good luck, everyone, this week, and have a great trading week.